In consumer tent and nighttime, running out now to make the switch to digital television. The FCC making a new push now to make sure you are able to watch TV after that switch next month. Right now, 69 million television sets are still not prepared, meaning they'll only display static after February 17th. Kurt Ludlow is live tonight to show us the confusion and funding problems that have many still not ready. Kurt? We are counting down here at 10 TV, Andrea, 42 days until the big transition to DTV. Many of you, most of you are ready. Many of you, though, are not. And the problem is a government program to get you a coupon like this so you can get a converter box like this has run out of money. If you haven't prepared for the transition to digital, at midnight, February 17th, your picture is going to look like this, leaving viewers like Christine Higby looking at nothing. I can't understand it. If you bought a new TV after 2004 or have a cable or satellite hookup, you're all set. But 15% of households in Columbus still get their signals the old-fashioned way. Rooftop TVs or rabbit ears, they'll need one of these, a $40 to $80 converter box. The problem is the billion-dollar federal program to help you buy the boxes with these $40 coupons has run out of money. Higby is running out of time. I guess they just completely mis miscalculated or, you know, we're not thinking about how many people we're going to get converters. Consumer reports found that 90% of Americans know of the transition, but it also found that 25% mistakenly believe they must have cable or satellite, and 41% mistakenly think every TV must have a converter box. In Columbus today, they need to take certain steps to be prepared to continue to watch TV on February 18th. The chairman of the Federal Communications Commission answered questions. What should we tell people? And tried to clear up some of the confusion. When you get your, uh, your coupons, they'll come and they look just like this. Especially over those coupons. If you haven't applied for your coupon yet, just because they're saying that they might be running out of money, you still should apply. Because uh, they, first of all, they say that there may be just a waiting list they might put you on. And Congress is already talking about giving them more money to the program. A waiting list for the coupons is six weeks long, so for many of you, it's already too late to avoid having your programs interrupted. Now, if you're not sure whether your TVs are ready, remember, 42 days, get ready for the next DTV test that's coming up a week from Thursday at 7.30 p.m. You'll have five minutes to check all the TVs in your house. That is Thursday, January 15th. Reporting live here at 10 TV, Kurt Ludlow, 10 TV News. Kurt, thanks a lot. For more information on what you need to do before the February switch and how to get on that waiting list for a voucher, visit the DTV section on the front page of 10TV.com. On Capitol Hill, the new Congress opened for business with controversy.